Australia shares the frustration of the great majority of countries more than 77 years since this General Assembly adopted Resolution 181, a plan for two states side by side, one Jewish, one Palestinian. 77 years later, that Palestinian state still does not exist, long held out as the promise at the end of a peace process that has ground to a halt. We have sanctioned Israeli extremist settlers and will deny anyone identified as an extremist settler a visa to travel to Australia. But individual country actions alone are not moving the dial. This week, Australia has convened a group of ministers to pursue a new declaration for the protection of humanitarian personnel. This declaration will be developed over the coming months to demonstrate the unity of the international community's commitment to protect aid workers and to channel that commitment into action in Gaza, in Sudan, in Ukraine and in all current and future conflicts. We see some states trying to set us against each other when the challenges demand that we come together, that we stand together in support of the security, prosperity and sovereignty of all countries. Australia has a different vision for the world. 